My name is Shreem Shepaz and today I'm going to tell you what Change Starts With Me is all about. Change Starts With Me means if I want to see a change in the world and make things get better, then I'll obviously have to start myself. In our world today, there are so many problems facing us. Climate change, racism, and right now we're going through a global pandemic. In a time when there is so much confusion and fear in the world, I want to take place to make things change. But you might say, you are only one person. How can one person do everything by himself? To that, I answer that it only takes one domino to fall for all of them to tumble down. So I must try start with myself. Build the change in myself before expecting to see it in the world. Because of course, I cannot change the minds or control the actions of seven million people, but I can work on my own mindset and my own actions and hopefully inspire others too. To help fight the issues that I've been talking about, I strive to be an accepting and an open-minded person to help racism to help fight racism on an individual level. This means at least one more person in the world who can feel happy and safe about who they are. See, this is not that hard. Climate change. Climate change is a really, really big issue in the world right now. But if you and me can work together, we can fix this today. By myself, I'm turning off the lights that are not being used in the house, walking instead of using the car, and avoiding using the air conditioner all night long. Because so many of us are in lockdown right now, I'm not a doctor who can help coronavirus patients get better, but I can do other things, like giving homeless states who don't have food, helping small businesses, and practicing social distancing. I can do that by not going outside and playing with my friends like I usually do. I absolutely know that I would love more acts of kindness, honesty and character around my surrounding environment all around the world. I can do this by encouraging others to have a chance, letting everybody be a participant and letting others be comfortable around me. I can do this by cheering people up and making my fellow peers around me believe in themselves. It is really important to try your absolute best and achieve your goals. I strongly believe that it is really important to help others to try their best and try ourselves at the same time. Since I want to see more acts of kindness and friendship in the world, I am going to start a chain with myself by doing random acts of kindness, like complimenting a random person on the street, helping my dad, making my sisters laugh, and making artworks for my cousins. This will inspire others to do random acts of kindness, which will make amazing friendships, and this change will hopefully make you guys be way happier too. If you want to see a change in your life, and you want things to get interesting, then you have to change the way you think and believe in yourself. Everybody can control their actions and thoughts. For example, I find it really, really important to be positive and to stay strong. This is a lesson that I learned from my mother. My mother had cancer for six years. Throughout her battle, she fought very hard. Her positive attitude is what inspired me and my sisters to be strong too. She knew that the way she thought, the attitude she had, would affect and change her health, and us, her children, would think. So she lived according to change starts with me. She didn't say sad and cry about her sickness. Instead, she told us to stay strong and never give up hope. So the point I'm trying to say is that our mentally view of life starts with the change that I bring in myself. See, this is how important change starts with me is. And how important implementing it, it is on myself. At the end of my speech, I would like to say a quote by Mother Angelisa. Everything starts with one person. It doesn't matter if you're five or 105. God from the old eternity chose for you to be where you are. At this time in history, to change to change the world. Stop the chain of change today. Thank you for listening to my speech.